So, All right, here we go. Round number two, our only match that features uh, two charter members of the same charter fighting yeah. each other. Thor, was that fun? Always fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of envious of that. Of the the ring the ring announcing yeah. part. It's it's a good I'm, time. I'm a little jealous. It's a good time. I like I like that. You know, Can you, like, reading and talking at the same time is definitely not my strong suit. But you know, um, I, I I do what I can. Do you channel your your like inner Michael Buffer? No, I can't. I don't have that. I don't have those kind of pipes. You know, I really <laughs> yeah. don't. I really don't. Director David's rendering Josh and uh, Blue Fighter Mike, our Ooh. red fighter. Josh opens up with a quick one nothing lead on that shoulder strike. So a little known thing about this here: this fight is is a, is a highly controversial fight within the Minnesota Charter. Um, th this is a widely talked about fight. Everyone in the charter is like, oh, who's going to win between this fight? No one can come to like a, a, like an agreement of who would win. And so I put this, this, this fight together because the charter wanted it. They wanted to see Broodnell, the brood, fighting Wilcoxon, and now it's happening. Josh got the reach. Mike's got the speed. You know, you know, you you, you got power and reach uh, for for Wilcoxon, and you got the brood with style and speed. Oh, oh, oh. disarm! Keep going, with a brood. Strike. Three nothing, four nothing, in the opening round. Second match of TSL Resolution Three. Ooh, you Mike's know, definitely uh, kind of the. Uh, I'm uh. Red gets on the board, four to one now. You know, I gotta say that I'm I'm definitely shooting for Brood on this. Uh, Brood now. I'm pretty sure I picked Josh Wilcoxon in my preview video. Just gonna say I don't know who's gonna win this fight, but uh, I want to see Brood winning this. I'm pretty sure I have to go with my predictions, so I'm gonna say Josh. Yeah, we gotta not be on the same page. That's true. <laughs> That's first simultaneous of the match. Three simultaneous when we start losing points. Yeah. No push-ups. We don't have time for that. We're on a tight no, schedule why, here. That's why I Push-ups afterwards. <laughs> Red gets the point. 4-2. Wilcox is coming out strong. The Venom gear looking gorgeous. Yep. Mike in the black and red as the red fighter. Josh Venom in the blue fighter. You know, the thing is, though, Broodnell has been training two times a week for the last couple months. So He looks sharp. Know, He's 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 been putting in the work. His footwork, his footwork right now is yeah. is nice. I've fought him multiple times in the last few months, and Blue this gets guy, another point. This guy's a contender, you know. He's definitely a contender. Someone to look out uh, look out for in 2019. Yeah, definitely. 19. That's what I said. 2019. Oh. No. See that reach? Boom! Though, man. Yeah, that reach is Dude. tough to get around. You Six know. to two now. Uh, I'm just gonna throw it out there. Like uh, Wilcox is probably like six two. Yeah, at you least. Know, Rudnell's like maybe five nine, five eight. Uh, what did it say in his bio? Five I mean, nine. I want to say. Yeah, that's that's it. That's yeah, hard. five nine in yeah. his bio. Yeah, that's hard to uh, to make up for right there. That is, that is. And you can see that Wilcox is taking full advantage of that until then. Seven. Yeah. He's got a seven three advantage still. Will Coxon. Oh no, blue. Yeah. Got, no eight three advantage. Eight two advantage. Yeah. Jeez, I can I can tell numbers. Yeah. Well, I mean, we can't actually see the scoreboard from where we're at. We kind of have to look around. Um, Nine two, round point for uh, Will Coxon, blue fighter, in the Venom gear. That's a pretty. That's a pretty clean uh, sweep right there. He's got about a minute around. and thirty left. Classic Wilcox. There's a lot there. of movement in this match. They're oh, yeah. both they're both very you know movement based fighters. Ooh, there ooh, it is. Ooh, precise. Yeah, Mike right got in, in the there. Heart. Nine four stays alive. <laughs> Round point still for Josh Wilcoxon. You know that was a killing strike right there. That was ooh, right in the heart. goes for it. Goes ooh. for it. Oh, Josh closes it out. Takes round one. Ten wow. four. He went down to the ground. And he recovered. Well, he went all out for it. it yeah. It was either I'm going to get this point or I'm going to get hit. You yep. know what I mean? And, and it's it's round point. So what has he got to lose, really? You know, nothing really. Yeah, <laughs> nothing really. He's got to take it home. Yeah. 
you either stay alive or you end the round either way he's got his fellow charter members in his corner um, no one's in uh, Wilcox's corner they're all over there on broods interesting maybe there's some controversy going on there <laughs> a little bit you know Oh, we're already get, well, here we go. Round Venom, number two. Venom just needs a host. <laughs> <laughs> Venom's always ready to go. Yeah. Judges are ready. Fighters are ready. Tables ready. Commentators are ready. Let's go. Round number two. Let us know how the stream is going. Uh, if we're lagging, we can uh, absolutely use another uh, streaming source. So please give us some feedback on how the uh, streaming's going. Um, we got volume is okay. It's all right. Oops, simultaneous. First of the round, no score. Round number two, fight number two. Yep. TSL resolution three. Footwork, moving around, moving around. Yeah, that's Active all. fighters. Oh, I saw blue on the back. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he's like, you can dance back all shoulder. you want, but I'm going to hit you in that leg. You know? Just taking that reach and using it. You know? If you got it. Ooh. Well, that was that was Brood on that. Brood took that home. Brood took that. 1-1. One, one. Yeah, the last exchange. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yep. I was talking about the exchange prior to that. Oh. Um, nothing. Another Simultaneous. Yeah, that was a good call. Okay. Second one. One more. We start losing points. See, this is where the fighters are adapting now. You know? That's another, another level. So Round number two, the feeling out period's yep. over. Yeah. Let's get down to the business, right? Now they're in the relationship. <laughs> now they're in the relationship. <laughs> it's going to be Facebook official by round three. Yeah. <laughs> They've gotten to know each other. Um, you know, they're comfortable actually, you know, talking about that being together and whatnot. And, so <laughs> <laughs> and, and now they're, they're meeting each other's one, family. One, two, Mike with a one-point advantage. Yeah. Blue ties it up. Two, two now. Yeah. This doesn't surprise me. This is great. Good. Good. Very good. Faster the fighting, choppier the video. Audio is great. Thanks, guys. That's, yeah, that's something we can't really... Um, next fight, do you want to try streaming on YouTube and and uh, we could. I know we're taking a break in between uh, the, once the the tag team bout happens before the last three fights. We might want to switch over then. Okay, we could try that. We'll do half of the sh half of the show on Facebook, half of it on YouTube. Yep. <laughs> Blue gets another point. Now three to four. Mike Brudenell, our red fighter, with a one point advantage. Nice. I just red, to, red with another point, five three now. I also want to mention, you see that mat out there? Yeah, that's from one one of our direct sponsors, Zebra Mats. Zebra Mats, shout out to them guys. Yeah, they are our, our sole uh, mat supplier for TSL. That 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 was a different curve because this is one of the first. This is the first event we've actually had the mats for. Yep. So I'll be curious to see how that affects the fighters in any way or how it benefits fighters in some ways. You know? Yeah. It'll be interesting in some of your post-fight interviews, maybe, to ask them how, how the mats, you know. Speaking of that, I should yeah. probably do that after this fight. Yeah. Maybe. I mean, I'm kind of in, in a zone on the commentary, so we'll see. I'm definitely going to do a pre- and uh, post-fight co commentary on the uh, main event. The and championship the bout. number one contender oh. fight, too. So much, so much riding on this card tonight. It's crazy. All right. We are... Seven to five. Mike Brudenell with a two-point advantage in round number two of the second fight of Resolution Three. Blue gets in there, cuts it to a one-point advantage. Seven to six. We got about a minute and a half remaining in round number two. Good honor. Yep. Good honor right there. Red gets another point. Eight to six. Opens back up a two-point advantage. Oh, that's a quick, a third quick round. wrister. Yeah, I think I'm seeing it too. Nine to six. It's round point for Mike Bruden now to go one round to one round, and we go to a decisive third round, which you know I love those. Ooh, no. I didn't see anything. Simultaneous. Yep. Blue no, gets no, it. He, okay. he got it in. He was already there. Okay. Nine Will seven. Coxon was already Stays in. alive. He's doing his classic. He's baiting him. Baiting him. There it is. Blue again. Two straight points. Nine eight with a minute to go. Still round point for our red fighter, Mark Brudeno. Blue ties it up nine nine. Mm -hmm. This is the match right here. Match point. 
Nine nine. If uh, Josh Wilcoxon gets it, the match is over. Let's if uh, Mike gets it, we go to a decisive round three. It's the most intense moment of the evening. Yes. <laughs> oh, Blue gets it. Ten to nine. That's nice match. Winner. Round. Winner, match number two, Josh Wilcoxon. Wow, two matches, two excellent, excellent matches. Yep.